Hey, what's up, guys? Zek here, and welcome to this World Guard tutorial. Uh, so this is Derps here. She's not in the call, but actually she is in the call, but her mic is muted. So uh, let us get started. What you're going to need is World Edit and World Guard two server plugins and bucket. So all three links are in the description below, and you can just go and download those before we start. So now that you have those, what you're going to need to do is slash slash wand. And it'll be a lot better if you have some knowledge of World Edit. So as you can see right here, this house is not completely square. So it is not going to be super easy to protect. But what we are going to do is we are going to find the corner. So here is the corner of the roof. And we can see there's blocks along here and blocks along here, but nothing on the outsides. So we're going to select this bottom grass point. Now we're going to go to the other end, and now you have two choices. Either you can go up here, and then slash up space one, and it'll make uh, glass beneath you on the corner. Or you can go down to here, find the corner, which is right here, select it with right click, last time with left click, and you're going to type in slash slash expand vert, and that'll protect all the way up to the sky and all the way down to bedrock so now that you have that it is just basic commands from here on out so you type slash region define and then the name of the region so we're gonna call this house and then your username mine is xyzek so the region is now saved as house so to make sure you did it right do slash i string one if you have essentials or go into your menu and get some string into your inventory so now that you have string, you're going to right click the house anywhere and see where it says applicable regions, house and omega. It should say applicable regions and then your region. But I am in my omega realm server where the whole entire kingdom is protected. So I am also in the omega realm. But as you can see, if I right click out here, it's not protected. Shut up, Terps. You're not going to correct me. So this is house. Okay. So say that you don't want to let people PvP in this area. So you can like punch people and stuff. Or you don't want people to be able to punch people. You're gonna type slash region, oops, slash region flag, the name of your region, and then PvP space deny. And it'll say region flag PvP deny. So Terps, come in here please. Just walk on through this door. And when I try to punch her, ah, she's in creative. Get out of creative! noob get out of creative oh see now it says you are in a no pvp area oh it god mode loser so it should say you are in a no pvp area if it worked correctly but say you don't want monsters to spawn you're gonna do slash region flag the name of your region and then mob or i, I think it's monster spawning deny and if it's not if you type something wrong it here let me turn my chat higher I just did this so it wasn't annoying but over here it will show you everything so it's actually mob spawning not monster spawning so let's go and edit this very quickly so we'll change this to mob spawning deny and if you want to see this list just do slash region flag your region and then a random random letters and it'll be like nope that ain't no region and then it'll show you all these regions that you can do like don't let people build or er, on default people can't build but if you do slash region flag house build allow now terps try to break that door break the door it doesn't matter so see now she can break the door because build is allowed also, there's prevent potion splashes, don't let people do commands, uh, let people buy the regions, uh, stuff like that. So that is basically it for World Guard. Uh, if you have any specific flag questions or protection questions, all you have to do is PM me or post a comment. So that is it for this tutorial, and do you guys want to come say some words? Hi, I'm Derps! That's Derps. Hello, I'm Nicky Bro. That's Nick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and that's Cade.